money that quickly without pissing a few people off. I mean, you could if you, like, just want to scratch yourself. Oh, damn, dude, I got, like, a million dollars. Holy fuck. Or he's just really fucking nice. Yeah, or he's really nice and he's just being nice to people. Got him money. Fucking hey, like, hey, you would man, we really don't like I got the money, but he's such a nice guy. Here, something. Go over there. Oh, he answers. Nah, I'm dead. Here, someone will take over from that. Literally anyone, please. Please. Oh, I gotta do another stretch. I can't do it while also play. She wearing pants? In the 40s? What? It's so long ass fucking pants. Take a break. Nice pants, would you get in the 70s? Idiot. The recent deaths of four musicians. The 70s call, they want the pants back. Good point. The 18th days never had phones, they won't go. Tons of army surplus morphine showing up on the street. If you care about working in this town, you better give me something on Biddleston and Bo. Or their knucklehead buddies, Tyree and Lamont. And this is your idea of making inquiries on the stone floor? Bum, bum, bum. Sometimes about speaking that German gibberish at me outside. How about you get a drink while I see this? He's ready to throw hands. He has, he has hit her before. Roy, take a seat before Where's I make you down? take a seat. Make you take a seat, Jesus. Take a seat, Chancellor. Why antagonize him? No. Take a seat, Chancellor. No. People are dying of overdoses. If you know anything about it, you need to tell me. I can't help you. Well, You're a fucking junkie you yourself. There's nothing special about your voice. <laughs> you can do this the easy way with me, or I can call my partner back over. I can assure you. He, he hasn't even finished his first drink yet. You think your I think. Me? Yes. Black man knows the pine nothing. You think there's a black man in this town holding on to two tons of morphine? He'd be dead in a minute. White man supplies, black man buys. You don't even have teeth, shut up. <laughs> My partner mentioned a couple of names. You recognize them? I have no idea what you're talking about. I don't like names. The only way you're going to get rid of me is to give me an answer. I knew Cornell. We worked together a few years ago. He loved the music, but the music didn't love him. What? What does that mean? <laughs> It exactly. means that he just wasn't that good. Dang. He was a sad, lonely cat. Boys, One dickhead. take five minutes, please. I need to have a private word with the officer. Piss off. And you and guys you also don't have talent. Get off. Get off the stage. Against the law, Elsa. You're so full of courage. You have never felt the shame. This is getting us nowhere. Do you think you'll win your war against narcotics? It's not my war. It's against the law. My job is to prosecute the laws of this city. Do you think you can stop people from needing drugs, detective? I'm asking the questions here. Then why do you come to me with your stupid questions? You know who controls the drugs in this city. It's not enough to just survive, Elsa. You have to try and make the world a better place. Big words. Very noble. Just Shut up, you're a Nazi. Don't get into a singing bill. <laughs> Do you know where to find him? This time of day? You'll find him holding court at the Macambo. You can wait. There's something I need to be sure of. Give me till tomorrow morning. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, partner. What wouldn't you do? Not drink. drink. Uh -huh. Want the poo -poo. You have a right to do her. <laughs> Is that a taxi? Maybe someone would actually not fuck up the chase scene. Hey, I got the car one first try. I hate the stupid on foot ones. You're a fucking silly car on the sidewalk toys. Because it's stupid. You're not on the fucking road. Shut up, so I'll see you playing. I'll say I did 
fucking offering. I just did like a couple minutes ago. <laughs> you didn't offer it. You almost pushed them. Yeah. It's, it's still, it's the same thing. You still could have taken it. Just turn on your siren. Yeah, turn on your siren and <laughs> fucking <laughs> floor it after her. <laughs> Pull her over and ask where she's going. <laughs> and then ask if you can go to. Get going. Stopping on the crosswalk. It's not illegal, it's 1940, you can park anywhere. Especially when you're a white man and a cop. You know who I am? I'm white. My bad. <laughs> hey, you can't park there. I'm white. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> I need some proof of you being white. I need some proof of whiteness. <laughs> Look at my skin. Oh, yeah. I listened to. <laughs> oh fuck! It's the whitest music from the forties. Cause everyone kind of just listened to the same shit. I was death like, metal. I listened to death metal. Oh man, you fucking white as hell. Whiter than shit. Don't do it. I'm <laughs> just move the fern in front of it. What the fuck? Darn fern knocking on the door again? <laughs> what? Come in. Roy tailed <laughs> you. We're looking like a fucking cretin out there. Suit. You wear it every day. <laughs> LAPD, we're looking for Mayor Cohen. I believe he has lunch here. There's not going to be any trouble, is there? Which table? Number three. If you'll follow me. Dookie. <laughs> not going to be any trouble, is there? Shut up. Which table? Wow. Oh, sister, I was so tight I couldn't. LAPD. Walk. Sister was tight. How's it hanging? Fine. Just so fine, tight boy. she couldn't walk. I see you brought Iga Beaver along. Hope he's not going to put the shakes on me again. Paul Phelps. Shut up. Punch him. Mickey Cohen. Good afternoon. <laughs> he has manners. <laughs> Aren't you a little green for this kid? Meet Johnny Stompanato, Cole. He has the biggest schlong in Hollywood and the smallest gun. Or maybe that's the other way around. I can never quite remember. You're a funny guy, Roy. Haven't I always said what a funny guy Roy is? How much fun it will be to get together with him sometimes. Poor Johnny. Well, He's the dark, guy. sensitive type. He's a serviceman too, Cole. Johnny was in Okinawa. You were in the crotch? Sixth Marines. The lieutenant who won the Silver Star upon Sugar Loaf. A birdie. Something like that. All right, have we finished flirting? You got something to discuss, Roy? Or are you going to stand around beating the meat while my lunch gets cold? We have some questions. Do I need my lawyer? Your brother in law, Lenny Finkelstein, was selling stolen morphine. We had one third of the shipment. Old news, kid. I don't know anything about what Lenny was up to. I <sighs> always don't news. know. <laughs> so I'm supposed to believe that you don't know what happened to the rest of the shipment. Lenny, God rest his soul, was a moron. He was family, though, and I haven't made a beef about that, so count yourself lucky, kid. The H is a filthy habit. I don't condone it. The simple solution would be to have all the dope fiends put down. So you don't know where he got the morphine? Kid, ask a question you might get an answer to. Hey, shut up. You believe <laughs> shut up. Between a group of Marines and the morphine stolen from the SS Coolidge. One of those Marines was shot to death in a club last night. I wouldn't know anything about that. I mean... You're a mobster. I feel like you 
probably do. It seems like it should Even if you had heard like, anything about what happened nothing to actually do with it, I feel like you what might. What can I say, kid? I'm shocked that in the land of opportunity, Uncle Sam's finest feel the need to resort to crime. It's a dangerous business. I can attest to that. I'd recommend they get out of the life quickly. A few Negroes saying goodbye on the sidewalk will never make a page. Watch it. <laughs> That's not a good word. White people popping their clocks makes everyone nervous. You know, dope has never been my thing, Roy. It's always been for Schmendricks like uh, Jack D and Jimmy Atlet. But uh, I'll who and who? And I'll get back to you. And you boys want some lunch? How about a drink? We'll take a rain check on that. Come on, Cole. We're leaving. We have to cut that dope. It looks bad when people die. We have to get the rest of it. There's no way of watering down the stuff in those little packages. You have to put the squeeze on those guys and get the rest of it. That'll seem to type of fright now. I don't want to be squeezed. Grab him by the nuts and squeeze. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking rat stoker. Oh my eyes, <laughs> stop it. Oh, that is kind of great. Brenda is LA's most famous. And the guy in the. Officer Alpha, he's a tr real trooper taking all those flashes. Our job is to keep it off the streets so Joe Citizen and his wife can stroll around unmolested. Then we should change the law. Are you out of your mind? Every politician in America is against prostitution, except when they're using them. So where does Stoker come in? He objects to the LAPD and the administration taking its cut. Is everyone in on this? Yeah, and that's the problem. From a little acorn does a large tree grow. He could bring the whole thing crashing down on us. Aren't you supposed to be working the... Uh, sir, do you know which robbery detectives are working the army surplus theft from the Corridge? Caldwell and McManus. I saw Caldwell in the squad room not long ago if you want to speak to him. Thank you, sir. We'll do that. This <laughs> way. Okay. I saw Caldwell doing drugs in the other room. I don't know how to talk to him. Oh, okay, thanks. Harry, you got a minute? Hey, you look like you're busy. Sure, Cole, anytime. You've been working the dock robbery on the SS Coolidge? Yeah, that's right. So how do you see it? Inside job. Either the guys working the wharves or some of the guys on the ship. What else was taken apart from the morphine? Case of BARs, case of Thompson's. Great amount of smoke. Homicide just recovered three BARs and a mountain of cigarettes at a shooting at the 111 Club. No kidding. I better get over there. Do you have a copy of the manifest? Yeah. Here it is. More manifest. But you're supposed to get up and leave? So, I know what more manifests. Just go. Copy? Oh. Sheldon. Kelso Jack. Sheldon Courtney. We know those guys. Sheldon Cooper. Wow! Bazinga! Bazinga, I'm doing morphine! Enough to arm three companies. There's our backroom arsenal from the 111 Club. This is the great we recovered. 245 pounds of fucking knives? That's a lot of knives. These guys are from my old unit. Oh, that cigarette just oh. appeared. Also, that's what he made to cut. Goldrick. Like, holy oh, shit, that's all I cut. Sure, Goldrick bought the 111 Club, Harry. His brains are all over the bar. Looks like whoever stole the dope is getting muscled. By whom? Dragner or Cohen. They control the hop. I can't on my own. 